Um, his first oh, is a big animal. You are worried about your exam. So, what is going to happen? See, Swami says your system of education is only called examination. No education. There is no education happening. Yes, it's about examination and you moving to next grade. That's all. You're, there is no education system happening. Okay? The whole thing, idea is only examination. You don't learn anything except study this, study that. You have a lifestyle of going back home, doing your homework, doing your projects, write exams, go to next grade. Maximum you have one or two hobbies of going playing tennis or swimming or some classes. But that's it. But that's not life, that's not education. It's a such a boring life. Gurukul, we also have examination, but they run for examination. They're so happy. Because they know very well. See, suppose if you are asked, you are in 7th grade and you are asked to write the 1st grade exam. How many of you will find worry about the examination? How many of you will be worrying for your examination? The 1st grade exam. <laughs> Writing your exams of 1st grade, who will be worried? None of you is raising the hand. Why? Yes, exactly. Once you teach the kids how to remember things very easily, then why would any kid have a problem? So if suppose this is a class, can Manvita has them listening? How Gurukul works? There will be all kind of age groups. It will not be only 5th standard kids together. It will be like more like a Montessori system where 7th, 6th and 8th will be together. And understand if we are talking about one subject, probably physics, about light or even easier about nutrition of the fruits and vegetables. One team will be making a play on that. One team will be making a story on that. One team will be singing a song on that. And the other team will be doing some <coughs> visuals, diagrams on that. And this is how a class they learn. They do not sit with the board in front of them and the teacher talking. This, 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 light, this is what happens, nutrition. This vegetable has this nutrition. It's such a wonderful thing. Gurukul kids have made a video on the nutrition that each vitamin is a paramahamsa. Each vitamin is a paramahamsa and the disease come for darshan and get healed into that for that paramahamsa. If there is a vitamin A deficiency and then those you have to go to the eye paramahamsa and then that doctor that paramahamsa heals. So they actually do a play. Avatar. Who is the paramahamsa? Manikyananda. So they play in such a way they enjoy the whole subject by enjoying the whole subject they learn it forever, goes to the permanent memory and they have so much fun. So the minute they finish, they shout out for worksheets because they know too much. And then they wait for the exam because they know so much. Because they enjoy learning, they learn too much. They much more than what they can learn. In a very fun way complete fun. Constantly into creative way of studying. It's not necessary for the teachers to come and explain. The kids will also prepare and explain the class in a most game manner. They'll create a game out of it and everybody will play. For example, they have a bingo for states and capital. 
and they do that around like one week and they learn the states and capital so fast. They have they literally do bingo. You all know bingo? Yes. Yeah. So that's what they do for states and capital. They have constantly different games and different songs. So examination does not bother them. When you have so much fun, you remember everything. When you sit and listen in a class. It's so boring. Who wants to sit and listen in the class? And write 10 times and homework after that 100 times. They have homework. They ask for homework. Because they know so well, they want to say, I know so much. So it's like doing a first standard paper. They are so happy. They run, finish the homework, they finish everything. Because they know so much. And we don't put all condition 10 times right. If they have to learn spellings, they write it upside down. This is what we give them. Write the spellings upside down, you'll remember much better than writing it 10 times. Because you'll be doing with more awareness. So there's so much fun way of learning things. Why won't you take a homework like that? Yes, that's why. That's why Swami keeps talking about Gurukul. Amazing way that kids love, have fun, learn and also don't suffer of any patterns. No sadness, no anger, no upset, everything is fine. What kind of a lifestyle or what kind of a civilization that will be? Creative. That's going to be the creative generation which is what the world needs now. The IT industry has gone, it's going to be a creative age. Where you're going to be thinking out of the box. When you grow up and you find a job, that's what you'll be going for. Whoever is creative, in creating new dimension of work, is going to be successful. So, there's no point in worrying. At least, drop the worry and write your exam. Don't add more to yourself. At least, you know these emotions are fake. <laughs>